Hi guys, this is the second part of the let get rid of condensation together videos for the purpose as you know in the first video I already presented to you this headlight with condensation issue and I already identified pointed out two small damages which can be the source of the condensation and I already stated that the previous owner of the car has made a wrong diagnosis and thinking that the headlight lens is not sealed properly the previous owner has added silicone all, all around the lens but apparently this wasn't the real source of the condensation and the condensation issue wasn't solved as stated in the first video I made uh, I drove your attention to these small two small damages and stated that most of the time not to say over 90% the lens is not the guilty one for the condensation but usually there are always some small damages at the headlight now in this part in this second part we will make a double check for the condensation source via uh, a bubble uh, bed or if you can call it soap bed we will make a bubble bed for this headlight and we'll see from which points the headlight is breathing the headlight should breathe only via these air vents and no other point there are four, four air vents, vents at these headlights we have here one we have here one on top three and we have one more here except these points the headlights shouldn't breathe now let's go to make a bubble bed
Now we are back from the bubble bath and what we found as you saw during the bubble uh, bath lens is okay the ceilings are okay as you saw there there were no bub no bubbles at the ceilings so uh, the lens ceiling is not the condensation source this proves uh, right our first assumption that it's not the lens then after we check the other points we discovered that this one as we initially told is not okay this repair with some kind of a glue is not okay hasn't done the job so we have to fix it not okay then we had another damaged here damage here we should address this small hole as well this is also a source of condensation because the headlight is breathing from the from there and then what we found actually as an additional co concern was the cover caps these cover caps has a wear and tear during the last uh, uh, more than 10 years actually the rubber the ceiling of the covers has a deformation so they are not sealing properly the headlight and as you saw in the during the bu uh, bubble bath these should be addressed the headlight was breathing also from the covers from both covers although the top cover was more problematic but also at this points you saw that this cover also has a old seal it is not sealing the headlight properly anymore and this should be addressed i will tell you in the third part what should we do the trick to solve the issue with the covers in this video i am just confirming the weak points of the headlights so in the first video we addressed only two damages first one was the this small damage a small hole it left a small hole after a broken tap and then it was obvious that this repair wasn't success, success uh, a success story and then we also found that the back cover should be addressed at this stage in the next video in the next video i will take care for all these weak points of this headlight and hopefully we'll stop the condensation issue at this headlight see you in the third video all the best bye for now